I, I've, I've done Orlando like most people, you know. Uh, I've got three daughters, so I've done the parks a couple of times throughout the years. Um, of course, I've done a couple of shows over at the Abbey Theater, and um, based on that experience, I just couldn't wait to come back. They were the best audiences I, I had really ever sung for. I just I, I love the city. I love the, the arts community here. Because of your connection here, I mean, did it, did it hit you maybe a little harder when you read about tragedies or hear about tragedies in more far-flung places? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I was uh, like the rest of the state and the country and the world, um, just devastated um, at what happened to your city. And um, I, I live in Florida a lot now. I, I film down in the Keys a lot um, on a, a television show. We're getting ready to start our third season. So I've just come to really love the state. It's kind of my adopted state for the last couple of years. And um, it felt very, uh, very raw. And uh, but I know it's a state of, of resilient, amazing uh, people, so they're, they're healing. When a community, when a person suffers um, a traumatic loss, um, it's a long process um, for, for the individuals, for the family, for all the victims' families, for the whole city. Um, you, t you have to just go one step at a time, and uh, you really lose your, your faith that the world is a good place. And so tonight, the world is going to be a very good place. It's going to be filled with a lot of beautiful sounds and beautiful people and, and tons of support and great music. And just for that, just for that little space of time, there's going to be some hope. And uh, that's, that's as much as anybody can really hope for.